Hello, welcome to this video. My name is David Isamoji, the owner and founder of Water T-shirt Design. In this video, I'm going to make a super quick video for you on how to design a simple log team T-shirt, a ty um, typo typography kind of T-shirt for you. Uh, it sells well. Yes, I know for sure it sells well because if you check on Etsy, you see that. Check on Match by Amazon, you see it sells well. So without wasting much of your time, let me open my Photoshop. Going to open my Photoshop right about now as you can see it's opening it's going to be a spark quick video so please if you've not subscribed i will ask that you subscribe right about now thanks very much if your subscribe button is super red make it super gray by clicking on it and turning on the bell notification thanks and let's get to work so to start with i open a new um layer i'm going to be using 4000 by 500 which is the standard by match by amazon so i'm going to press ok and just wait for it to load as you can see it has loaded so you see this padlock here i'm just going to click on it twice double tap i mean press ok now this is done so that i can turn off this background at the end of the design so without wasting much of your time i'll just go straight to the design so i'll come over here click clicked on this t so i'll just come over here change this to uh let me say let me make it pink uh, okay, let me make it pink and see. So I'm just gonna create this type log. As you can see, it's quite small, so I'll light it. Still small, but I'll leave that for now. But since I'm doing it, let me just press enter, control Z, just come back here. So now you can see it's quite small. So to increase it, I'll do my Alter key button, shift key button, left mouse button, pressing end down together to increase. But before I do that, I'll do my control T. So I light all the text. I'll move my mouse to this edge. Then I'll press my alter key button, shift key button, left mouse key button, and drag outwards. So now that I've dragged that outward and I'm okay with the size, I'll just press enter. Then I'll come back to this text, click on one of these play, then I'll control A to alight all, and I'll just find a good font which I'm okay with. Let's find a good font. Okay. Just try to look for something. I'll just keep going till I find something I feel is okay. Just keep scrolling. Just keep scrolling. Let me see this. Log okay okay this looks good let me see if i can see get another one let me see if i can get another one okay ctrl z so this looks okay you can use this so i'll do this to do ctrl C and increase this a bit again so auto key button shift key button left mouse key button or drag outward sorry about that so auto key button shift key button drag outward with your left mouse so I'll just press enter move this down a bit okay now I'll just bring in um, an element which I downloaded Downloads log um to be hot. Okay, so I'll just take one of these hats, just bring it into the design. Yes, it's quite big and I would like to reduce it, so I'll go my mouse to this edge, alter key button, shift key button, left mouse key button, drag inwards. I'm okay with that. Press enter. I'll just move it. I'll just move it there. You can see I'm okay with this. I'm okay with this. So I'll just try to make our double tap here. Try to make it. Um, I'll click on stroke and I'll make the stroke white. I'm doing this just in case I want to transfer it on my. Um, on a black shirt so I don't have to go through this stress again so I'll just make the stroke pen press ok and now I'll turn off this background 
I'll save this as love. I'll save this as love. Love five. Because I already have so many in this series, so I'll just save this as love five. Save it as PNG because if you save it as JPEG, you have a background on it. But if you save it as PNG, you have no background. So just click on save. Save. So now the next thing we want to do is to go over to our pictures again. Mock up. This one I just want to transfer it to our mock up. Because mock ups help you your design to sell more. So I just want to transfer it to our mock up. And here I'll be able to explain to you why I put the strokes on that love element I downloaded earlier. Sorry, I added to my design earlier. I'll show you why now. The love. So I'll just scroll and look for okay. This is it. I'll just drag it into this layer. As you can see it's there. And I'll just reduce this. Okay, I'll just reduce this like this. Press enter and I'll click on save. You know, remember it was on the black shirt we started this design on. If we go back, it should be on the black shirt, but you can see it's made that that white stroke I created now is showing here because it's on a black shirt so that's why you can see it's showing so it's super cool and I'm super okay with it and all I have to do now is save it if, you, if I come here and remove this so I get this I think I like the white so I'll just leave it as white and I'll just save it as love for love Five full full version. I'll just save it as PNG. So with this one now, you can just send it to to an influencer on Instagram, on Facebook, on if you have a love group, a very large love group where they talk about love matters. You can just put this there and tell it to help you promote it, and you pay them a cut from the money, and you make the rest of the money. It's as simple as that. That's how we make money from. Red Bubble, Teespring, Match by Amazon. So if you'd like to watch more videos, please click on the link to your right. You see the playlist. You can click one of the playlists or any video to watch more. Remember to subscribe. Thank you for watching. I'll see you on the next one. One love. Peace out.